Hello and welcome to another episode of Coffee Fusion. This week we're going to look at how to practice a new latte art design. So whether you're just starting out with your latte art or whether you're a seasoned barista and you want to design something new, um, when you're going about practicing some new latte art, if you follow some steps, it's a lot easier. So I'm going to take you through all those steps right now. First off, nut out what it is you actually want to pour. Now if there are multiple aspects to this new latte art design, try practicing uh, each element separately first. Next try a simplified version of the pattern you want to pour. Once you've done that, take your first shot at the pattern the way you envisaged it. Now when you pour that pattern for the first time, you might notice uh, that it doesn't feel the cut right or perhaps you uh, went about pouring it the wrong way. So try and see how the milk moves as you're pouring it and make any adjustments you might need to make. The main thing I noticed with this pattern is that um, when you're pouring, you've got to be really careful about your jug. Um, you'll see with this one, when I pull through, um, I take the pattern with me when I pour the second half. Um, so it's really hard to get that jug position right. After this, it's time to practice that pattern over and over and get sharper details with each of the elements. So, so, so. Uh, states and then uh, nationals and then worlds coming up again. 
So this week for Free Ball Friday, let's stay away from the basic patterns. Uh, forget the tulips, forget the single rosettas. Um, let's work on something and uh, pour some really, really cool, intricate designs. Speaking of Free Ball Friday, let's see who won this week. Jason Smith won with this uh, pour here. So he's already won his shirt, so you guys have to knock him off next week. Remember Free Ball Friday is on every Friday, so join in the fun on the Facebook page. Thanks for watching this week's episode of Coffee Fusion. Remember, if you haven't already, like Coffee Fusion on Facebook, follow The Coffee Fusion on Instagram, and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Remember, Coffee Fusion is bringing coffee lovers together.